the energy of a photon can be written as E is equals to H V, which is of course equals to H C by lambda. From here, if you see this two, we can write down E by H is equals to E by C is equals to H by lambda. <coughs> But by the hypothesis of de Broglie, this can be written by hypothesis of de Broglie. This is again set to be as momentum. So finally, we can write down here momentum equals to E by C. So this is the initial one. So when it falls on a perfectly smooth, so suppose this is this one, and when it is falling on this, so without this is a perfectly smooth surface. Without any deviation, it will move back in opposite direction, having the same magnitude. So let P dash be the momentum of the from the reflecting surface of the photon. So P dash equals to will be minus E by C. Here minus is the negative term opposite to the initial one. So change in momentum. We know the change in momentum is this minus this. That is change in momentum equals to Minus e by c, minus e by c, which is equals to minus 2 e by c. So with this much energy or this much momentum of will be transferred again to the atmosphere.